and welcome back to Race Recap. My name is Jackson. This past weekend was the Arkham and Art Series racing at the world's fastest half mile at Winchester Speedway. There are 200 laps. The first caution was brought out when the 10 of Brandon Varney spun after some contact with the 18 of Ty Gibbs, who was lapping him. The second caution was a competition caution. The third caution was a big crash. Actually, it was a red flag as well. The 21 of Daniel Dye was making a move underneath the 17 of Taylor Gray exiting turn 4. And coming down the front straightaway, looked like Dye was about to have Gray clear. But for some unknown reason, not sure if they had a problem on the previous lap or so, but Gray came down right into the side of the 21 of Dye, and Daniel Dye went spinning down towards the inside wall, made contact with the two of Nick Sanchez hard, and Sanchez ended up hard into the outside wall as well. Fortunately, they were both okay, but in a post-race interview, Daniel Dye and the 21 did say Taylor Gray has one coming next weekend, so watch out for that. The fourth caution was a competition caution. And the fifth caution was brought out in turn two when the 20 of Corey Heim spun after some contact with the 18 of Ty Gibbs. Not sure if it had anything to do with the few weeks ago at Elko Speedway when Corey Heim made contact with Ty Gibbs, but it was sure coincidental. And during an overtime restart, Ty Gibbs did win the race. So the top 10 here were Ty Gibbs, Greg Van Austin, 35. Great finish for him. Actually, his best mark in our series finish. Corey Heim was third, then it came Thad Moffitt, Taylor Gray, Brandon Varney. Great finish for him as well. Parker Chase, Chris Wright, Tony Breidinger, and Co Tony Costantino round out top 10. Lots of DNF in this race. D.L. Wilson had brake problems. Daniel Dye and Nick Sanchez both out for the accident. Alex Club had power steering issues. Brad Smith had a brake problem. And Owen Smith had electrical issues. Well, that's all for race recap. Come join us next week when the Arkham Menard Series races next from Watkins Glen.